now let's go back to your field you know your talks on the other side now as a doctor why do you feel healthcare is very low in the country and um, there are a lot of stories of what happens in the hospitals uh, people are unsafe, people are dying, you know, most especially when it comes to women giving birth and all that. So what is your take on the issue of healthcare in Plato State and Nigeria as a whole? Well, uh, thank you very much, uh, Lucy. This is something that is very dear to me. Very I've important. spent my entire career in this. And for me as a public health physician, prevention is better than cure. Now, we have preventive health services. You have childhood immunization, you have all, you know, environmental sanitation, etc. You have care, care for the people that, you know, are living with long-term disease. Then you have treatment of acute illnesses and also chronic, both infectious and non-infectious diseases. What are the structures for this that we need to pay attention to? We start from the primary health care level. And for me as a public health physician, to reduce the pressure in the secondary health facilities is to have an effective primary health care. Even if this primary health care is currently the responsibility of local government, as a state uh, government, our interest in that is to provide all the enabling environment, the human resources that they need to be able to ensure that primary health care is effectively carried out. Exactly. Every village needs to have a functional primary health care. But let's go beyond that, where the state has a primary responsibility, and that's the secondary health facilities. I know that there are issues of resources, but I also know that it is very possible to make the hospitals function in such a way that with the little that they have, they are able to care for the people that come down the door. One of those key things is the training and retraining of healthcare workers. I do not think the number of doctors that we have is sufficient for us mm -hmm. to be able to provide the care that we need. Ditto for nurses and the, health, uh, the others. Mm -hmm. So, in spite of the leanness of our resources, and I know that's a big drawback, we need to ensure that in the areas where you have a higher prevalence of disease, or higher uh, uh, outpatient attendance, you have got the number of people that will take care of them. <laughs>